Am I the a-hole for taking over a family therapy session with my rat? I'm 16 and currently in family therapy with my dad, his wife, my sister 14 and step siblings 10, 9 and 7. This blended family thing is pretty new still with my dad being remarried for two years. My mom died so I only have one home. And I'll be honest I was never excited or really into the whole blended family thing. But I know that's not my decision. All three of my step-siblings have food allergies, two have bad ones. So the way we eat has changed a lot. This included places we ate at that were a part of traditions. For most of my life we eat at this local noodle bar in town for the end of the school year and whenever we had a school thing play, graduation, report card, etc. And we're not allowed to go there anymore because of the allergies. Even just with dad it's a no-go. We can't bring ice cream into the house anymore because my my step-siblings can't eat it. Only my dad and his wife can prepare food so no more making a sandwich for myself either. Birthdays have changed. My sister and I can no longer eat at our preferred restaurant of choice because of my step-siblings and we can't bring my favorite dish into the house either. So now it's a place that my step-siblings love and is acceptable for their allergies. For two years dad has talked about how glad we are to make all these changes and how family is worth it. About four months ago, his wife noticed my sister and I weren't engaged with the family in the way she thought we'd be. We didn't want to talk to her. She also noticed my sister had cut me and her out of some photos of all of us and and used just me and her for her room's art wall. So she and dad decided we needed some family therapy. Since we started about two months ago officially, there has been a lot of what's the problem, why are we there, explain the problem. And my dad has also talked about all the good from a blended family and changes were mentioned, and he talks about how happy we all are to make them. Well, last week I got so sick of it, and the therapist asked me if I was truly okay with them, and I went off. I said no I'm not. That I hate the changes, that it's unfair. That I never said I wanted my step-siblings to celebrate my birthday more than I wanted my favorite foods, that these things were decided for me. I said I never would have made that decision because celebrating with them isn't important to me. I'd rather have a good time with the people I love and enjoy food that I love instead, and that I hate not being able to make a sandwich or buy snacks after school. I basically went off for the whole session between a rant and answering questions the therapist put to me. My dad is so mad at me for doing it, and his wife was really upset because her kids heard it. But she was also upset because she accepted it on some level. I didn't want this ever. She's also kinda mad that I took up a whole session with my wrath. Am I the A-Yol? Here are the top comments, plus Opie's reply. Ugh, entitled parents. Kiddo, you're here, asking if you were wrong to use the therapy you were shoved into. No, sweetheart, you're not wrong for that, nor for any of your feelings around your stepfamily. It was not your choice for them to join your family, and had your father not pushed this, you likely would not have been as against this. It's not your fault you weren't considered in this life-changing choice. I do not believe you can tell your dad not to date, marry, or whatever, but your dad, likewise, cannot demand that you be okay with choices made without you. Not the a-hole. And your dad needs to back off unless he wants to lose you and your sister. OP replied. Yeah. Exactly. Like I can't tell him not to marry and I can't ask him to stay single just because mom died. I always got that. But he just assumed he could say we were a family and suddenly we'd love these people and want them and see them like he did. Not the a-hole. Your dad could have taken the time to have private dinners with you and your sister at favorite spots occasionally. It shouldn't always be about the blended family. And not allowing you to make a freaking sandwich when you are hungry is nuts.